Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to The Wolf Among Us for more comic book point and click action. We are right back where we left off, about to go to the Woodland Luxury Apartments in Fabletown to continue on with the game. Uh, so far I'm really enjoying it. Uh, we're back in control of Bigby Wolf, the hero slash anti-hero. I'm not sure why he's coming here. Is this where he lives, maybe? We'll see. Um, and if you haven't already done so, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell down below the video so you get a notification to your device every time I upload. <sighs> and as always, guys, thank you all for your ongoing support. Okay, let's do this. Um, I'm going to chuck the warning out there. This episode could contain scenes which some viewers could find upsetting or distressing. Um, it's quite a violent first episode, so I'm going to use that for this series just in case we see anything a little bit too violent and um, people didn't realise. So let's um, carry on. What's this? A sign. Stay off the grass. Right, okay, let's, um, I guess, head into here. Who's that? Looks like a lady hiding behind that tree. Don't make me come over there. Don't make me come over there. Look, I've got an hour of paperwork ahead of me, and I've already had to deal with... Wow, an hour of paperwork. Tonight, so, just... Sorry, Bigby. Didn't mean to be an asshole. Beauty. Beauty. Hello, Big B. From Beauty and the Beast, maybe? Oh wow, she's on the grass. I wasn't expecting anyone. Uh, you're out pretty late. Looks a little odd. You're out pretty late. Is there some sort of curfew I don't know about? What's with the third degree? Just wondering. Damn it, I'm late. I am the sheriff, after all. Is she getting in that cab? Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Oh, okay. He worries too much as it is, and it would just uh, make life a lot easier. Oh, jeez. Um. Please. Uh, okay, I promise. You promise? We're doing the good guy thing. Thank you, Bigby. I'll explain it all, all to right. you later. I will, but I have to go. Okay. Uh, oh God, I'm not sure we should have done that. Maybe Thank it'll be okay. For trusting me. Really, I I appreciate it, Bigby. If you say so. I don't really want to be covering for people. I'm not really sure that's my job as sheriff, to be honest. But we pressed that, so now we've got to live with it. Hopefully it doesn't come back to bite us on the bum. It probably will. Knowing how the choices I make in these games usually go. Oh, here we are. Fast asleep. I uh, wonder if we've got any post. Been a while since any post? Oh, I'm guessing not. We'll check anyway. Seventh day in a row. Seventh day in a row with no post. Nobody loves Big B. Uh, let's have a look at the desk. Fast asleep. Isn't he supposed to be guarding things? Hey, you wink. Doesn't look like it. Probably for the best. Yeah, probably for the best. Um, what's this? A suit of armor. My catch needs to dust this guy. Okay. Um. Wow, there's a lot of dust coming off that. I wasn't kidding. Um. Okay. Oh, what's this? Woodland Directory. Let's see. Are we on there? Beast, Mr. and Mrs. Uh, oh, okay. Didn't really get a good look at it. Um, anything down here? Doesn't look like it. Right, let's get in the lift then. Uh, we'll press the button. Uh, okay. Lift. Oh, here we go. Where are we going? Do we live here? I think we do, don't we? Who's that? Bigby, hey, wait up. Have you oh. seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Oh, is it Beast? Um, 
Oh god, staying out of this. Have you? I'm staying out of it. Out of what? Whatever it, it is, beast. I'm not a marriage counselor. Damn it. Something's going on. I mean technically we didn't confirm or deny anything, did we? So we avoided the question, there we go. It's probably a good way to go, actually. We didn't break the promise, but then we didn't get involved, so... Got myself out of that situation quite nicely, actually. Makes a change for me, doesn't it? Bigby's apartment, Fable Town. Oh, so we do live here, then. Oh, we're taking the phone off the hook. Oh, well, it's a bit of a dump in here, isn't it? Wasn't it open already? Okay, we're having a wash. Nice wash. Not even in the shower, just at the sink. Do we not? have a proper wash in this game or <laughs> refrigerator let's look in the freezer see what's in there ice cubes Damn it. even that looks empty hopefully we've got something in the fridge he's got to have some dinner right ah oh, there we go what is that I don't know not much in there was there um, what's this Bluebeard folder. Let's have a look at that. Bluebeard's file. Anything worth looking at? Never trusted this guy. Oh, apparently that's it. Oh look, there's some food here. Chinese food. Ordering that. Probably a bad sign. Okay, I guess we're not eating it then. There's a fan here. At least this still works. Let's put it on. Yay! That'll circulate a bit of air. Oh! Why is there a pig on the sofa? What the hell? Uh, Colin. Who the hell is Colin? Uh, okay. Should we talk to him? Hey, Colin. Get up. Get up, Colin. Okay, we're gonna have to push him, I think. Oh, poke him. Oh. Hey, Big B. Who the hell is this? I'm in your chair, huh? Uh, yeah, get out. Yeah, get out. Ah, oh, poor pig. Who the hell is Colin? Is he one of the three little pigs? That's the only pig I can really think of from a fairy tale. I like how he makes pig noises and also speaks. Another smoke? cigarette. Take that as a no. Oh no, we are. We're giving a pig smoking. That is one of the most bizarre things I've ever seen in a video game. Thanks. A couple thousand more of these will be even on that house you owe me. Oh, it is the three little pigs. Because of course the wolf blew the house down, didn't he? Well, the house of sticks and the house of straw. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some House prison, of Bricks, of okay? course, stood firm. Don't send me back there, Big B. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Don't be dramatic. Oh, that's a little dramatic. So is he another one who ran out of glamour? That for me. I'm guessing glamour's really nope. expensive then. The house didn't blow itself down, Big B. That's Supply and demand saying. and all that. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... <laughs> it would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. I just want some rest. That was all you Let's were not be a jerk and drink in front of him. Rest. Just I to prove a point. Back. This is why everyone hates you. Everyone hates me? So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. I'm doing my best here. Clearly, that is not true. What with the selfishness with the bourbon. But, uh, well, no. Uh, you know, you're a pig. You shouldn't word. be drinking bourbon, I man. I fear you more than 
anyway. We should be you drinking water and stuff. In your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Very well, true. I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. To be fair, I couldn't help that man. He just started on What'd me. You in a fight with a fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. My job. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables. No, so defend I myself against the one that tried to kill me with an axe. Fuck you. <laughs> Colin will remember that apparently. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big, big and bad. Being bad. Oof. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. <laughs> I like this cutting That's guy. He's really sarcastic. In trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Uh, not no, not that Name lady. One. Uh, I'm Beauty, and there was a girl. Uh, I don't actually know her name. Awesome, great example. What is when you make it sound like that? Life is easier with friends, Bigby, and we live a long fucking time. Yeah, I know it's you true. like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself, but I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. <laughs> Wait, that doesn't make Just give sense. me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. Can we actually give him a drink? He seems like quite a cool guy. Second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I. Look. Give you this. Yay, this. give him a drink. Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Give Colin a drink. Why not? Have some bourbon, man. Knock yourself out. We're going to be nice. Thanks, we did baby. blow your house down after all. <laughs> a long time ago, I'm guessing, but... Oh my god, look how he's drinking it. I suppose he is a pig. He doesn't have hands. Really? We're just going to go to sleep like that? Okay. That's one way to go to sleep, I guess. Who's at the door? Uh, where the hell did Colin go? Here, piggy, 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 piggy. Uh, okay, open the door. Straighten our tie first, you know. Big B. Who's this? No. Come with me. Snow White? Might be. It's gotta be Snow. Snow White, right? Called Snow. Snow. What? Sorry. There's I'm... no one else called Snow, is there? What, what is... happened? What happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to Hi. Hello. Who's this? Good morning. Or some ginger dude. <laughs> yeah. Who's he? What character is he? These walls are. This is not important. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. Why? What the hell is going on? Oh, it's not something to do with beauty, is it? Maybe we should have told Beast where she went after all. Oh dear. Who knows? Uh, so I think that's probably where we're going to end it. Um, because the trophy's come up to say that's the end of the second chapter. So we will continue on and see what was outside in the next episode. Wow, it's um, it's getting interesting. There's obviously something big which has just happened. I'm not sure what it is yet, but we will find out. And Colin was pretty cool, wasn't he? I liked Colin. I mean, Bigby's apartment is an absolute dump. But I'm quite glad we got to give him a drink in the end. I think, you know, giving him a glass of bourbon and a cigarette after what we did to his house back in the Three Little Pigs is, you know, a nice gesture. Getting there towards, you know, apologising for destroying his home. 
Uh, but there we go. So that is going to do it for this episode, guys. So, as always, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.